Shaft-driven motorcycles are often touted as having a maintenance-free method of delivering power to the rear wheel. In reality, they're low maintenance. Sure, you don't have to lube, clean, or adjust a chain, but there is some work required on a shaft drive motorcycle. Today on MC Garage, we talk about shaft final drive maintenance. There are plenty of motorcycles out there with a the shaft drive, especially in any segment that has the word touring attached to the end of it. Some cruisers also rock a shaft, and of course, Moto Guzzi foregoes a chain or a belt drive. But usually, when most riders think about shaft driven motorcycles, a BMW with its pair lever design comes to mind. And today, we're going to be doing a final drive oil change on a 2019 R1250 RT. The list of required tools is short. You'll need an Allen bit, a container to catch the old oil, a funnel or squeeze bottle with a hose to get the new oil in, a torque wrench, and oil resistant gloves. Used gear oil is pretty stinky stuff and you don't want the smell to hang around on your hands even after you wash them. You also need hypoid gear oil, a new crush washer for the filler bolt, and a new o-ring for the drain bolt, if you can remember to pick one up. I didn't, so I'm going to give you a warning about that a little later. You'll need to use hypoid gear oil rather than just regular gear oil. Hypoid oil has extreme pressure additives to handle the extra heat and pressure between the ring and pinion gears in that rear end. Draining the oil is pretty straightforward. I like to drain the oil with the machine slightly warm as things flow a little quicker, but it's not really necessary. Start with loosening the drain bolt and removing it. I do this first without the filler bolt removed so the oil won't come out so quickly and get all over your hands. After the drain bolt, pull the filler bolt and let things drain. Once the oil is drained, check out the drain plug. It's magnetic and will have some fine shavings on it most likely. Any big chips are a sign that you've got big problems in your rear end. Clean off the plug, but remove the O-ring first if you don't have a replacement. Contact cleaner can cause the ring to swell and not seal properly. When you're all done, install the plug with a new O-ring and torque it to the proper spec. Then you need to add the gear oil. This takes patience. The filling process will be slow going because the oil is thick. There are a few special fill bottles out there, but a funnel will work if you've got the time. If you pour the oil too quickly, oil will go everywhere, so take your time. Once the proper capacity is added, replace the filler bolt and torque it to the proper spec. Well, that's it. Follow your maintenance schedule and use the right oil for the job and you should have a trouble-free, low maintenance life with your shaft drive motorcycle. Thanks for watching MC Garage. If you like what we're doing, hit the like button, subscribe, and as always, put your question in the comments down below. We'll see you next time.